In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. <coughs> the Lord be with you. My dear sisters and brothers, today we celebrate Saint Monica. We pray that through the intercession of Saint Monica, today is a special day that we pray for those all those who walk away from our from their faith and believe in God we pray that through the intercession of Saint Monica all of them at the end of their day they will say again that they believe in God and then also we pray, remember our families also our own families who walk away from their faith in God let us remember them in our minds and heart today. And let us pray for them. Knowing that our God is full of mercy and compassion. Let us call to mind our sins. I confess to Almighty God and to you my brothers and sisters. I have greatly sinned in my thoughts, in my words, in what, in what I have failed to do. Through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask, Blessed Mary, ever virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. And may, and may Almighty God have mercy on us. Forgive us our sins and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. And let us pray. O God, who console the sorrowful and who mercifully accepted the motherly tears of Saint Monica for the, for the conversion of her son Augustine, grant us through the intercession of, of them both, that we may bitterly regret our sins and find the grace of your pardon. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. A reading from the beginning of the first letter of St. Paul to the Corinthians. Paul, called to be an apostle of Christ Jesus by the will of God, and Sosthenes, our brother, to the church of God that is in Corinth, to you who have been sanctified in Christ Jesus, called to be holy with all those everywhere who call upon the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, their Lord and ours. Grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. I give thanks to my God always on your account for the grace of God bestowed on you in Christ Jesus, that in him you were enriched in every way with all discourse and all knowledge as the testimony to Christ was confirmed among you so that you are not lacking in any spiritual gift as you wait for the revelation of our Lord Jesus Christ. He will keep you firm to the end, irreproachable on the day of our Lord Jesus Christ. God is faithful, and by him you were called to fellowship with his Son, Jesus Christ our Lord. The Word of the Lord. The responsorial psalm, I will praise your name forever, Lord. Every day I will bless you and I will praise your name forever and ever. Great is the Lord and highly to be praised. 
His greatness is unsearchable. I will praise your name forever, Lord. Generation after generation praises your works and proclaims your might. They speak of the splendor of your glorious majesty and tell of your wondrous works. I will praise your name forever, Lord. They discourse of the power of your terrible deeds and declare your greatness. They publish the fame of your abundant goodness and joyfully sing of your justice. I will praise your name forever, Lord. Alleluia, alleluia. Stay awake, for you do not know when the Son of Man will come. Alleluia, alleluia. The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Jesus said to his disciples, Stay awake, for you do not know on which day your Lord will come. Be sure of this. If the master of the house had known the hour of night when the thief was coming, he would have stayed awake and not let his house be broken into. So too you also must be prepared, for at an hour you do not expect the Son of Man will come. Who then is the faithful and prudent servant, whom the Master has put in charge of his household, and to, and to distribute to them their food at at the proper time. Blessed is that servant whom his master on his arrival finds doing so. Amen, I said to you, he will put him in charge of all his property. But if that wicked, wicked servant says to him, my master is long delayed, and begins to beat his fellow servants and eat and drink with drunkards. The servant's master will come on an unexpected day and at, at an unknown hour that will punish him, will punish him severely and assign him a place with the hypocrites where there will be a welling and grinding of teeth. The Gospel of the Lord. Today is a beautiful day for all of us to pray for those parents or, or adult children of any of our family who have left the church and who had left their faith for some reasons. Can a mother forget her child? Can a parent forget their children? Regardless how dark may it seem for the mother and the parents, they never forget their loved ones. And even they forget, God will never forget God's beloved sons and daughters. Saint Monica was greatly pained when she saw her beloved son St. Augustine walks away from the church and from God. But it did not make St. Monica to leave her faith and God. But instead, she keep praying to God. She did not give up to pray to God and to ask for God's love and mercy 
upon her child, St. Augustine. Because as a Christian, St. Monica believes that even she herself forget Augustine, but God will never forget her child. She believes that she is not alone in her journey because God walks with her always. But most importantly, she reminds, she remains faithful in what she believes and she is like the good servant in today's gospel who always stay awake and always prepared. He, he is always prepared to welcome the Son of Man at any hour. And at the end, because of her faith and trust in God, God listens to her prayer and grants everything that she wished for. Like St. Monica, today you and I are called to remain faithful in our loving God. When we are steadfast in faith and prayer, God will shower God's love and mercy upon us. Amen. Let us all stand. Let us approach our merciful Father with trust and faith and offer him our intentions. For the church, may Christ keep watch over her always and make her holy. Let us pray to the Lord. For those entrusted with leadership, May God give them the grace to see and to be thankful for the gifts in those under their care. Let us pray to the Lord. For those who feel far from God, may God remove every obstacle to their sense of security in him. Let us pray to the Lord. <clears throat> and for all of us who gathered here, may the Holy Spirit foster in us a constant desire to follow his promptings in our lives. Let us pray to the Lord. For the dead, May they soon enter into the peace of the heavenly kingdom. And we pray for Donnie Neal, Hector Soto, George Ventura, Albert Huerta, Andres Morales, and Ines Meadowcraft, and those with COVID-19, repose of the soul, Ruben Benitez, Mirela Contreras, Jose Cisneros, Monica Sanchez, let us pray to the Lord. And that the sick will be raised in health and spirit. We pray for Ireneo Prigo, Padre Haro Antonio Velasquez, Arthur Mendoza, Josie Hamlin, Maria Garcia, Amy Gonzalez, Teresa Reynoso, Susi Podilo, and family. And for those in our parish book of the sick, particularly those with COVID-19, Cesar Vasquez, Dora Fleitas, and family, Baltazar Martinez, 
and family of Ruben Benitez. Let us pray to the Lord. And for our mass intentions this morning, we remember and pray for the intentions of our parishioners. We pray to the Lord. And in the silence of our heart, let us now add our own petition. Let us pray to the Lord. God and gracious God, good and gracious God, hear and answer our prayer, which we offer to you through Christ our Lord. Blessed are you, Lord God, of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth and work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. It will become for us our spiritual drink. And pray, my brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. We bring these sacrificial gifts, O Lord, to celebrate blessed Saint Monica, humbly entreating that they may bestow on us both pardon and salvation through Christ our Lord. The Lord be with you and lift up your hearts and let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere, to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, through Christ our Lord. For in the marvelous confession of your saints, you make your church fruitful with strength ever new, and offer us sure signs of your love and that your saving mysteries may be fulfilled. Their great example lends us courage. Their fervent prayers sustain us in all we do. And so, Lord, with all the angels and saints, we too, we too give you thanks as in exaltation we acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord, God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You
You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, Jesus took the bread, giving thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it. For this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, Jesus took the chalice and once more giving thanks. He gave it to, he gave it to his disciples saying, take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of of our faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. And therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, O Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly, we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, Kevin, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy, welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Saint Joseph, our spouse, with the blessed apostles and all the saints, especially Saint Monica, that we remember today, seven holy founders of the Servite Order, Saint Philip and Nitzi, here in our church, who have pleased you throughout the ages. We may merit to be coerced and to eternal life and, may, and praise and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, all, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil, and graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. And Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And let us now offer to each other the sign of Christ's peace.
peace be with you. Peace be with you. Peace. Lamb of God. Behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world, and blessed are those who are called to the supper of the Lord. And let us pray for our brothers and sisters who are watching us from their home. The prayer of spiritual communion. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things and desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment Receive you sacramentally. Come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen.
after this holy mass we are opening for the confession Father Dennis and I are here to hear the confession and followed by the adoration with that let us pray May the working of this divine sacrament inflame us, Almighty God, on the feast day of blessed Saint Monica, that we may be ever fervent with holy desires, they abound in good works. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, in the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Mass is ended. Let us go in peace. Bendito, bendito, bendito sea Dios. Salutaris hostia, que celia pandis hostium, bella premun hostilia, daro pur ves Yeah, let us um, rosary. Okay, uh, today we pray the mystery of life. Let us open with the sign of the cross in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord. Who was conceived by the, in the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, dead, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the 
third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Mary, the mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Amen. Of God, pray for us, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead our soul to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Amen. The first mysteries of life, the baptism of the Jordan at the Jordan. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Let this day our daily bread, give us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Amen. 
glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, it is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to hell. The third minister of the Lord. The proclamation of the kingdom of God. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of you, one Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of you, one Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, grace the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Hail Mary, full of 
great the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now, Lord, we pray. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of Support the light, the transfiguration. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. As we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. 
the chief mystery of the life, the institution of the authority. Father, who art the head, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, and earth as it is in heaven. Christ have mercy. Lord have mercy. Christ graciously hear us. God the Father of heaven. God the Son, the Demons of the world. God the Holy Spirit. Holy Trinity, one God. Holy Mary. Holy Mother of God, Holy Virgin of Virgin, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, 
Mother of Divine Grace, pray for us. Mother most, most Pure, pray for us. Mother Most Chaste, pray for us. Mother Inviolate, pray for us. Mother Undivine, Mother Most Amenable, Mother Admirable, Mother of Good Counsel, Mother of Our Creator, Mother of Our Savior, Mother of Mercy, Virgin Most Prudent, Virgin Most Honorable, Virgin Most Renowned, Virgin Most Powerful, Virgin Most Merciful, Virgin Most Faithful, Mirror of Justice, Seat of Wisdom, Cause of Our Joy, Spiritual Vessel, Vessel of Honor, Singular Vessel of Devotion, Mystical Rose, Power of David, Power of Ivory, House of Gold, Ark of the Covenant, Gate of Heaven, Morning Star, Help of the Sick, Refuge of Sinners, Comfort of the Afflicted, Help of Christians, Queen of Angels, Queen of Patriarch, Queen of Prophets, Queen of Apostles, Queen of Martyrs, Queen of Confessors, Queen of Virgins, Queen of All Saints, Queen Conceived Without Original Sin, Queen Assumed into Heaven, Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, Queen of Families, Queen of Peace, Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Pray us, O Lord, Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Please hear us, O Lord, Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God. Let us pray. Then we beseech thee, O Lord God, that we, your servant, may enjoy perpetual health of mind and body, and by the intercession of the Blessed Mary, ever virgin, may we deliver from present sorrow and obtain eternal joy through Christ our Lord.
Jesus Christ, you gave us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Blessed be God. Blessed be His holy name. Blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be His most sacred heart. Blessed be his most precious blood. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the Consolor. Blessed be the great Mother of God. Mary most holy. Blessed be her holy passion. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. And blessed be God in his angels and in his saints. Holy Yeah. 